Hey there, ladies and gents. Welcome back to the vlog and happy start of the semester to some of you guys out there. I started a new semester at school today and I'm sure plenty of you guys out there are doing the same. And I learned today that there are actually 600 incoming freshmen into the computer science program at my university, which I think is awesome. And it got me thinking, and one of the most popular videos, at least at the time of filming, is the Stuff That CS Majors video that I made not too long ago. And it's got some really good positive reception, there were some great comments in there and things like that, so I thought that I would do part two of the Stuff That CS Majors Say. And some of these lines are mine, some of them are from friends that are also in computer science, so it's kind of a cumulative effort that got consolidated into this one video. So. Without further ado, let's go ahead and get started with part two of stuff that computer science majors say. So this is what the computer lab looks like. There's so many people. They're all CS majors? I've never felt so social in my life. Seriously, why do the lab machines take so long to boot up? I mean, really, it's like five minutes to boot. I found one machine that actually boots in like a minute. This is my lab computer. There are many like it, but this one is mine. Someone's at my lab computer. Class is open for registration. Look at all the cool stuff that I can take. Full, full, seven o'clock at night, full. Why is there no PHP class? Oh, but they have a basic Ruby on Rails class. Gotcha. That's some trash. Yeah, I tried registering online, but it said I didn't have the prereqs for this one class. I totally have the prereqs. Guess I have to talk to my advisor. What do you guys mean you're only doing walk-ins and advising? Maybe I should switch to software engineering. So I learned that there's only about 15 hours difference between software engineering and computer science. So I picked up a double major in software engineering. I'm taking 15 hours. I'm taking 18 hours. Is it normal to drop a class? Will it hurt my transcript? MIT students do it all the time? Well, this isn't MIT. I dropped this ridiculous class, so I'm only taking 15 hours. Sweet, none of my classes are before 4 p.m. I'm gonna sleep in every day. Yeah, I got five hours last night. I feel so lucky. You went to bed at two? That's a smudge early, don't you think? Wait, you stayed up and you still didn't work on the assignment? <laughs> Same, bro. What doesn't simply explain big O notation? One doesn't simply explain the Tower of Hanoi, Dexter's algorithm, the P versus NP problem. One doesn't simply learn MIPS. One doesn't simply learn Bash shell scripting. One doesn't simply explain the Michael Nero theorem. Student health is giving out free contraception? <laughs> I don't need that. Because my degree plan doesn't allow me any time to fornicate with other human beings. No, it's not because I'm ugly. Didn't you see my last video saying that you're a CS major is pretty much a green light every single time. Hey, did you go to the LUG meeting? Hey, did you go to the IEEE meeting? Did you go to the W2C meeting? Ever heard of Aircrack NG? I'm not saying I got root, but I totally got root. A tech challenge CS to an Overwatch tournament? Well, I guess it's high noon. Hey, hold my bottle. A tech challenge CS to a CSGO tournament? Bet they've never seen op kills this nice. Hey, hold my bottle. A tech challenge CS to a Halo CE tournament? Guess they've never been sticked from the other side of a mountain. Hey, hold my bottle. Have I ever mentioned how much I love PHP? At least seven times in the last video? All right. Yeah, I freaking love PHP. Version 7? What version 7? Well, that's version 7. We don't talk about version 7. Alrighty, ladies and gents. So, as you can see, plenty of shenanigans to be had in the halls of the computer science and engineering buildings. So, I hope you guys enjoyed. And if you guys are heading off to a computer science class, or you're starting your degree in computer science, or you're finishing up your degree in computer science, I wish you well, and I hope that you found some humor in these quotes that you probably hear on a daily basis and if you liked it definitely leave a like or if you have another thing that you want to add or like another clever line that you hear throughout the halls or throughout the day just put it in the comment section down below and i'd love to hear it and i'm sure plenty of other people would love to see it and comment on it as well and as always friends remember that you are wanted and loved and appreciated you have a special talent that nobody else has and the world is waiting on you to bring it out so muster a little courage go out into the world and change it that's what the world's waiting on you.